it's all rules in rocket building. So uh, the rocket has to be a certain mass to start. And then once it's a certain mass, it has to go a certain height. This year, 750 exactly. So any uh, foot you are away from that is a point deduction. And the whole flight time has to be between 48 and 50 seconds. Uh, and any second outside of that range is point deduction. And then all of this happens while carrying an egg on its side. And if you break it, you're disqualified. We just have been working since September, October to build this rocket that has like very specific goals. Uh, there are 100 teams competing, the best in the, in the nation, but I, I know that ours is the only one from Utah this year. I kind of overlook everything that's going on, just kind of how everything runs. And uh, Mac and Quinn, Mac covers the egg and payload. Quinn covers the engine and I just kind of fill in everything else in between. So I do like electronics and parachute, work with just all the rest of the rocket, kind of organizing everything and I'll contact them, let them know when we're doing stuff and get everything going for our team. We order these engines, they're F-24 engines. They come in these little kits, kind of pieces. You just put them, to, screw them together pretty much. They've got little O-rings and whatnot. You want to do practice ones before, it's really big that you launch two or three times before anything that's going to be a real important one because the rocket requires a lot of fine detail and adjustment. It all depends on weather and conditions, so you have to change it for every launch. You just want to always be prepared. The winners will uh, meet the president, huh? and uh, there'll be many scholarships. I think there's $60,000 in prizes. And, uh, but other than that, it's just an honor to go there. So that's kind of been our goal.